Hello guys, my name is Salman Khan. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how can you register your own domain name with pknick.net.pk. Uh, actually, it doesn't have to be pknick.net since uh, we can actually go with without.net since that's the new trend of registering your names now. So if you already have an account, you can actually go to the login window and then log in. But if you don't, then you have to create your new account. You have to type all this information, your name, last name, address, city, the country's uh, providence, and uh, zip code, email address, and then you'll find your email address. And then the phone number, username is important since this is going to be your username that you will be using to log in. And then the password, password is obviously it has uh, uppercase, lowercase, and then uh, it has to be probably eight characters long and some special character verify your same password again and then the password uh, question would be for recovery when you lost your password or you forgot your password then you should be able to uh, have that question that will be asked or probably some sort of a hint and then you have to answer that hint so that would be for your recovery procedure and then you sign uh, this agreement uh, by signing this agreement you should be able to create this account so once you create this account whatever the email address that you use you should be getting an email to your email uh, inbox so go to your inbox after creating the account and then uh, you might be getting the email with the link so what you have to do is click on that link so once your account is activated you have to come back here and then click on login and then uh, on, on login you have to enter your username since i have already created my account i already have an account i'm just gonna, uh, simply going to be entering my username and then the password uh, so here we go okay i am in um, okay so once you're in you go to register domain and then here you should be able to register your domain name since i already have a domain name that i want to register in mind you may have to find your domain uh, the domain that you want to register uh, i'm already logged in so let's select this one okay You submit your domain okay so here it's complaining about that uh, I don't have one I don't have a fund insufficient funds right so since I don't have a fund how to add uh, that fund or a credit so I can register this domain okay for that you have to go to the billing and then from billing you should be able to go to add domain credit and then there are four different ways you can add credit paypal credit card prepaid card and then bank draw paypal and credit card is the fastest way of doing it prepaid card is also fast as long as you have the credit as long as you have the prepaid card number and then how do you get that prepaid prepaid card number okay buy prepaid cards that's what you have to go that's where you have to go where you select your city Okay, let's select Karachi and then uh, you have all these resellers within Karachi that should be able to give you or uh, sell you that card. Sometimes you can actually even buy those cards over the phone since I have actually done that. Uh, okay, so once you have those uh, resellers, you can actually, they, will, they, can, they should be able to email you the card number that you can use. Otherwise, in my case, I think the fastest way is uh, using uh, PayPal. And then you enter how many credits do you want so i'll say i want one credit and then proceed to ch check out and then it's going to cost you about 19 dollars and then you click 
click on make payment at paypal.com Okay, so it should redirect back to pknet.net, but I'm not seeing anything. So what we can do is, uh, I think the best way is, let's go back in pknet.net.uk. Okay, so now I can see I have um, one submit domain application just make sure that it's the right one footage.pk and then submit a domain now I'm not getting I'm not getting a red uh, window okay confirm provisional registration and then there you go it's actually registered now okay to verify that it is registered there is uh, go to your manage domains and then see if it's there or the other way uh, the easiest way is uh, you can just simply click here and then see if the domain is registered now. PK. And here it is. So it's footage.pk and registered today. And then it's for two years. So the payment that you're making about $18 something or $19. Uh, it's actually uh, good for two years registration. So basically, you're paying about nine to ten dollars, uh, or less than ten dollars per year. And then, since we actually left this uh, billing content and name server blank, so it's saying you know, blank deleted here. And then that's it. That's all you need to register your domain name. And um, just so you know, I have actually also have an app that I created just to check uh, domain names. It's actually check.pk. You should be able to go here and then type whatever the name and it should actually give you uh, uh, the name that domain is registered to and then it was when it was created and then the expiration date. That gives you sort of uh, who is information about the domain name. Alright, that's all guys. Uh, thanks a lot for watching this video.